Hey, you want to know the uh, primary reason for a shutter mechanism failure? Yeah, you ever seen somebody's uh, shutter mech where the blades had folded in on themselves? I bet you thought they were tough stuff, right? Especially when they're uh, flapping back and forth at uh, 20 frames per second or whatever your camera is rated for. Yeah, they're actually Teflon coated Kevlar. Yeah, let's... Uh, this is the shutter mech from a uh, Fujifilm X-T2. By the way, if you want to call this flimsy, it's no different than any Nikon or Canon shutter blade. Yeah, this is... Let's show you how easy it is to bend one of these. Yep. Right there, stuck a permanent crease in it. Um, you actually get dust inside your camera. You're worried about a dusty sensor? You shouldn't be worried about that because it's super easy to clean your sensor, but you're never actually touching the sensor. What you're actually touching is the cover glass, so that's nothing to worry about. What's to worry about, however, is when these are actually reciprocating, and you have two curtains in your shutter mech, uh, let's say 20 frames per second, 10 frames per second, whatever it is, they're actually going back and forth over top of each other. And the reason why they're Teflon coated is actually to reduce friction and wear, obviously so, but you get a tiny piece of grit or dust in there. When uh, the grit or dust gets on one of the shutter blades and the other one tries to go over top of it when you're ripping them off at 10 frames per second, what that does is it causes them to warp at high speed. And once they start to warp, then they get worse and worse and worse. Oh my, this is the shutter blade in any modern camera. You think that's flimsy? Oh my God, it's flimsy. Um, the wonderful thing about them, let me uh, show you here. Let me zoom out. There we go. Let's uh, light this up, and then we're going to light up this other one here. Okay. And we got a little match burning here. Let's actually stick... Eh. You see, shutter blades burn really good. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, release toxic smoke, too, no less. Toxic, because nothing says cancer-causing crap like... Uh, let me pull it out of the water bowl here. Nothing says... Yeah, the other part, <laughs> it broke off like a cinder. And nothing says cancer-causing crap like burning Teflon-coated nylon. You see how that burn? It burns really good. Uh, here's a little secret no one's made a video about. Let me pull it out of here. Let me... Let me zoom in so you can so you can see here. <clears throat> Here's a fact: shutter blades in a modern camera burn like fireworks. Yes, indeed. <laughs> um, no lie, girlfriend. Here's the uh, first curtain. From by the way, it's not just Fuji, it's Nikon. So it's got tons of. Shutter uh, mechs from both Nikon and other cameras. Yeah, they're just, it's just, yeah. That's, yeah. You want to know the main reason to keep dust out of your camera? It's not to keep your sensor clean, which of course is a good reason. It's because of this. Yes. Yes, that's how flimsy shutter blades are in your digital camera. Yes, absolutely. And uh, they love to burn. <laughs> they burn really good. My problem is the toxic chemical gases that they release when you burn them. And crap you didn't know about your camera. <laughs>